Hello, welcome to LEV Toys. We've got the cutest little Disney Princess Junior's Lego to build today. It's an aerial themed one and it's got a little dolphin carriage in it, which is a great way for a princess to travel. It just looks like so much fun. I don't know quite how the wheels would work under the water, but she's got a dolphin to pull it, so <laughs> it'll be perfect. So we're gonna use this, we're gonna add it on to her big palace too. It's gonna be a nice little, little addition. So. First up, we've got Ariel, and she, well, she looks like the other Ariels, which is nice. We, <laughs> we know exactly what we're getting here. There, she needs a little starfish in her hair and a crown on the top. So she might be over embellishing for today, but I don't think so. She's joined by Flounder. Of course, she needs one of her little friends to keep her company in this set. Otherwise she'd get super duper lonely riding around in the dolphin carriage all by herself. And that dolphin has just knocked Flounder over because the dolphin is so excited to see Ariel. <laughs> right, okay. Now that the greetings are over, perhaps you could say sorry to Flounder. Oh, there we go. Flounder's okay with it all. Flounder's very forgiving and he knows you are just very excited. So let's build the first part of this. It's going to be the carriage, obviously, because that's the <laughs> that's what the name of the actual set is. So we need somewhere for Ariel to sit, and this is very clever. Look at how her tail actually fits in those partitions there. I don't know where Flounder's gonna sit, not there, because he was in my way <laughs> and I need to put more bricks on to keep building. So everybody needs to get out of the dolphin carriage just at the moment. Here we're doing really well. Here's the other wheel and now we just need to put kind of a little, a little pedestal up so that the carriage doesn't flop down and then we get some starfish lights on the front. <laughs> it's very cute. And the dolphin goes on here, so she can travel in style around the underwater world. That's really cool. I wish Flounder could fit on here though. Can't fit you in there really. Kind of. We'll fit you there. There's no studs, so I'll have to be careful and make sure that you don't actually fall off. Now, we've got the carriage. We also get a cute little abode for Ariel to hang out in. It's got a few more things, a few more items that we can add to her treasures and this lovely little printed wall with windows in it. Don't know quite how that works. The ocean would just come straight through, but it's nice to be able to see out. And this little semicircle is going to be kind of a balcony up on the top. I love the gems. They're just so pretty. <laughs> so sparkly. So if it goes, ah, uh, hold on, wrong way around. There, if it goes up here, that means it's, well, it's not really a balcony, is it? It's just a little roof, a little rounded rooftop, which is pretty. Now down here in her extra cute little living area, she's got a seashell something, a clam. Is it a bed? Is it a seat? Let's see, it goes over here. It's a seat! And I suppose if we actually lean it back, it could be a bed. She's also got a dressing table here with a mirror. It's got another little gem on the top and a brush and a little bucket off the side to hold her hair accessories. So we'll find them in a moment. So this is nice. This is actually going to be her little dressing room. And here's one of her extra, <laughs> extra hair accessories. And there's a wonderful pink sea anemone. Oh, for Flounder to perch on. That's so contained and so simple, but so effective and cute. There are so many ways we can play with this. So here we go. Ariel is here in the dressing room. She's busy grooming Flounder, but the dolphins found something really exciting. But the dolphin can't actually tell Ariel what the exciting thing is until she's had a nice brush and got a lovely hair accessory in. <laughs> so now can we go and find the exciting thing in the carriage? I think we can. Okay, here we are. Okay, are we off? Let's go, they've all had their scales brushed. <laughs> <laughs> Actually, dolphins don't have scales because they're mammals, but they've all been brushed and now they can come out here. There's this fancy lone piece of seaweed. 
Look at this. Look what the dolphins found. Another piece of treasure for your chest. <gasps> Look, Ariel. It's a dingle hopper. Just what you need. So you take this dingle hopper home. <laughs> what a wonderful treasure. And you can use that as a comb. Yes, perfect. Even though you've been supplied with a brush in this set, it makes a very nice comb too. There you go, such a cute little set and you can play with it so many different ways. I do hope you'll subscribe and click the little notification bell. Give me a thumbs up, leave me a comment and I'm going to see you with a new video very, very soon.